why real estate in Longmont, Colorado? Is this a good place to live? What are the best neighborhoods in Longmont? How far is Longmont from Boulder and Denver? What is there to do in Longmont? Hi, my name is Carla Howell with Boulder County Homes. In this video, we're going to explore residential real estate in Longmont, Colorado. We'll look at the housing inventory, the neighborhoods in Longmont, and listings. And if you stay till the end, you'll realize why buying real estate in Longmont, Colorado, the number one boom town in the U.S., is a great return on your investment. Let's get started. The cost of living in our area provided by thebestplaces.net is mostly driven by housing prices. You can see by this cost of living comparison map provided by bestplaces.net that all of the Boulder County cities with the darker colors indicate higher cost of living. And look at Longmont. It's a much lighter color. So that means that Longmont has the lowest cost of living in the county. There are other hidden savings in Longmont as well. For instance, the cost of utilities is very, very reasonable. And they're provided by the city of Longmont. Longmont provides an amazing fiber optic internet network. And it's available to all residential and commercial units in Longmont from 100 megabits to 1 gigabit speeds at a very reasonable cost at only like $39.95 to $89.95 per month. The local buses in town are free and in warm weather, there's hundreds of miles of biking trails in town, which also connects you to trails leading into the countryside, Boulder, and Niwot. You don't have to travel far to enjoy water sports on our lakes and reservoirs in Longmont. And with the St. Rain River running right through town, you can enjoy strolling along the river and inner tubing. And let's not forget, it's only 15 minutes west to the foot of the spectacular Rocky Mountains. And this fun and entertainment all year round in Longmont is at a low, low cost and mostly free. So let's explore the real estate in Longmont. Let's look at the last seven days in the Longmont market. If you, if you bookmark this site at bocohomes.com forward slash market report, you can pull this up anytime and get the latest market updates weekly. The dial at the top of the webpage will show you what you're looking at as far as the buyer's market or seller's market. That means is the market in favor of sellers getting top dollar? or is the market in favor of buyers getting a better deal? And then up here on the right top side, you'll find trends. The median price range is the middle point for all homes sold in this area during this week. The others will show the trend on different measurements. And then in the middle of the page, you can choose if you want to focus on the average 90 day median price range, or a seven day average, but you'll find that the 90 day makes most sense since it's a little bit less volatile than from week to week. The bottom section breaks down the market into four quadrants based on their current listing prices. The top 25% of list price all the way down to the lowest 25% of current listing prices. It shows what you could expect to find and the features of the quadrant if you paid the median price. For example, for a two, two, two and a half million dollar home at a median price, you could expect a home size of around five to 6,000 square feet, maybe a lot size of two and a half to five acres with five bedrooms, four and a half baths, maybe 23 years old. And then of all the new listings in that quadrant, two of them have already been sold as in absorbed. And so the average days of market in that price range is going to be around 161 days. If you're thinking of purchasing real estate in Longmont, this is a must have report updated live every single week. You know, these numbers will change as inventory increases as we move into the warmer weather. But as you can see, there's plenty of options for your budget. Some may be condos, townhomes, or single family homes. Do we have million dollar properties? How about a $24 million property here in Longmont? 
Mostly you'll see these types of listings in the countryside with sizable acreages, beautiful luxury homes, some with views of the Rockies. If you're looking for an urban city feel, then Longmont has you covered. Prospect Newtown is a popular neighborhood located in the south side of Longmont. Just off of Highway 287, it's located on an 80-acre parcel that was once an old farm. Prospect was created to replicate an urban town surrounded by open fields and views of the mountains. So the architects were encouraged to experiment with styles. It includes a mix of businesses, detached homes, row houses, live work lofts, and apartments. Structures resembling traditional houses from the early 20th century, while others are eclectic and super, super ultra-modern. You might just feel like you're on a movie set the first time you drive in to the Prospect neighborhood. You can expect to find home prices anywhere from $400,000 for a one-bedroom condo with a loft, all the way up to over $1 million for a detached single family home. It's common to find a carriage house over the garage on many of the detached homes. With some businesses and restaurants within the neighborhood, the locals love this mini city atmosphere and tend to stay there for a very, very long time. So listings can be few and far between. On the next part of my video, we're gonna look at live listings today, just to give you some perspective of housing costs in various areas of Longmont. And if you stay with me till the end, I'll share another video for you to watch that I think you'll really enjoy. And don't forget more videos in the description box below, including my contact information. I would love to answer any of your questions, so leave them in the comments, text, call, or email me. Okay, we are on my website right now. The address is bocohomes.com. You can use this free site and it's got articles, tips, and more videos, live market information, and a search by map feature. I'll leave a link below in the description box. Let's take a look. If you click on the search button, you can filter by city, price range, and several other options, but the key is not to over filter so you can see more of our inventory. We'll leave it as the city of Longmont, price range from $400,000 to $700,000, which should cover most of the median price ranges here in Longmont. You can go higher for sure. We do have areas in town that will be up to an over $1 million, mostly around the Lakes, Fox Hill Golf Course, and out in the countryside. There are different ways of looking at these listings, but I'm gonna focus on the map feature because you'll get a really good feel for where these listings are geographically located within the city limits. You can zoom in, you can zoom out, you'll, and you'll notice that as you select prices from the map, there's a red outline on the left panel where you can pull up that specific listing. It also works in reverse. When you highlight a listing on the left panel, you'll see it identified on the map in a red outline. When you pull up a listing, oh my gosh, there is so much information from the map location to the price to the number of days on the market, features, and more. You can even connect to my most favorite local lender from this page. Longmont is only 15 minutes from corner to corner. The downtown and central areas have the old homes from the 1800s to the 1960s. And as you spread out towards the edges of town, the homes become larger and newer. There's just a lot of variety in different price points, styles, and ages. We also have many condos and townhomes to choose from all through town and some new construction in the northeast, southeast, and southwest corner of Longmont. Whether you dream of owning a farm with a few goats and a few sheep and maybe some miniature horses, or you just want some space, or you want a charming old house and historic downtown where you can walk or ride your bike to all the restaurants and festivities, then Longmont is the place to be. And actually, you know what? All of our Boulder County communities, they're amazing. 
with open space, views, and trails. What are you waiting for? Come and check it out. I hope you enjoyed looking at the real estate options in Longmont, Colorado. Leave your questions in the comments and subscribe for more really great videos and tours. I'll see you on the next one.